Hi guys, Mike back here today at Columbia Ford in Columbia, Connecticut. Today I got another special, special, nice, beautiful review. And it is the all new 2020 Ford F350 Super Duty Tremor King Ranch Edition. Now before I get into the review, I just want to let you guys know that on May 27th, I'm having another iPhone 11 Pro Max giveaway, plus a $1,000 giveaway. All you guys got to do is hit that like and that subscribe button, guys. And you guys will be entered in to win a brand new iPhone 11 Pro Max and or a $1,000. Now, again, it's totally free to subscribe. All you guys got to do is hit that like and that subscribe button, guys. And you guys will be entered in to win a brand new iPhone 11 Pro Max. Now back to the review, guys. I just want to start off by letting you guys know that this thing sits on 35 inch beautiful Wrangler Goodyear tires. Now, it's also sitting on 20 inch beautiful black Ford rims too. So, as you guys could already see, this truck is no joke. Now, it does have a 6.7 liter power stroke turbo diesel engine. So, yeah, you guys already know it. this thing is a monster. As you guys could already see, it's absolutely one of the most gorgeous trucks that I've ever been able to do a review for. I know I've said that on a, quite a few videos, but it's definitely one of my favorite trucks in all time. You got the nice King Ranch F350 badge right there with the 6.7 liter power stroke turbo diesel badge right there. Now I'm gonna show you guys that beautiful, beautiful engine, that 6.7 seven liter turbo diesel engine yeah this definitely is one of my favorite favorite trucks of all time and this is the king ranch so they definitely have quite a few different trim levels so there's definitely many many options to where you can get the truck the size whatever you want to get they definitely have every different option you can imagine here guys you got the super duty badge right there and then you have that nice hood scoop that just dips in like that which is a nice touch to this truck as well and it's got an automatic car starter which is really nice so you hit the button the lock button on your key fob and then you hit this button twice and you hear that nice 6.7 liter turbo diesel engine oh yeah it was, that thing's purring right now and then you hit it twice again and then it turns off nice and smooth so if you live in a place like new england like i do it's a really good feature to have because nobody likes going outside in the freezing weather to turn on their car so it's a really good feature and then what i like about this as well you got the chrome front grill with that nice tannish color on the black as well which is also a really nice touch. You got the Ford emblem with the front view camera. And then you got your nice tow hooks. So this thing is a pretty pretty big monster. And it's also got the parking centers in the front and the back. So if you come close to getting into an accident or if you're about to hit something or someone, it's gonna alert you to let you know that you're about to hit something, which is pretty, pretty cool. It's a good feature to have, guys. It's also got a lot of power in it. So it's got 475 horsepower with 1,050 pound feet foot of torque. So this thing right here has a lot of power, guys. So if you guys are looking for that power, this is definitely something that you guys want to definitely come down and take a look at, guys. So you got your nice little tremor badge right there. And it does have a lot of chrome all around the truck as well, as you guys could already see. And it's got the power side steps, which is really, really nice. You got the nice King Ranch badge right here with the Super Duty badge, which is really, really nice. And then you got your backup camera. You got your trailering wire hookups. You got your trailer hookups right there. And then you got your parking sensors on the back and on the front so the parking sensors like i mentioned to you guys before if you're going forward if you're going in reverse if you're about to hit something it's going to alert you to let you know that you're about to hit something which is a really good feature to have now to get in your back of your bed hit that button and then your back of the bed goes down 
Now, to show you guys what it looks like with the back of the bed going down again, but with your key fob, press that button twice, and then it goes down nice and smooth. Now, I wanted to show you guys, well, it's this is only like a little bit of stuff that you can fit in the back, but I wanted to show you guys what you guys could fit back here. So it's got a lot of room, a lot of space, so it's got a lot of, uh, a lot of different um, ways to put a lot of stuff in here so it's a pretty cool feature now it does come in two different kinds of beds so you can get the steel bed or the spray and bed liner now this is the spray and bed liner everyone has their own preferences and my preference would be the spray and bed liner because it's a lot nicer look um but that's totally up to you guys now you guys got your back lights for your back of the bed back here and then you have your tie down hooks all throughout the back of the bed as well and your fifth wheel gooseneck which i will show you guys in just a second now another cool feature about this truck it has that nice little step and then it has a nice little pull-up bar to gum into the back of the bed so you hold on to this go on to this and then you go up which is nice nice and easy guys and then right here you have more trailering wire hookups which is pretty cool and then right back here you have your bed view camera so you can see your trailer and everything that's going on in the back of the bed now right under here is your fifth wheel gooseneck so that's where you would hook up your other trailer which is really nice because you can tow and haul even more with this kind of truck and then to get down you just do the same hold this bar and then step on the step and then you're good to go now to get this down press that button in then it goes down and then you hit this button and then that goes back in and then right here pull this up and then it goes back in just like that and then you just pop it back up and then you're good to go and then you got your nice tool two dual chrome exhaust pipes right back here which makes this truck look even meaner and you got the tremor badge right there and then you got the nice power side step that comes down which is all always a nice touch and then just look at the interior design that they did with this truck guys you got that nice wood interior design on the door with the nice tan leather you got some nice storage space down there you got your power locks your power windows you got the b and o sound system you have 10-way power adjustable driver and passenger side seats look at this interior guys just look at the interior look at the way that they did this interior you got that snake design for the texas that's why that's where the king ranch came from originated from was texas as you guys could probably already tell but look at this design for these seats like this truck is absolutely amazing you got the dual panoramic sunroof up there and then you got your nice big dashboard with the super duty badge look this is hidden right here it's a little button and then nice little storage spot in there pretty cool right and then you got your nice storage space in there which is pretty cool and then you got some more storage space right on the side as well. And I'm not sure if I mentioned you guys before, but you have 10-way power adjustable driver and passenger side seats, which is pretty cool. And then you got the King Ranch badge right there, which is also pretty nice. I just love that power side stuff. And then we're in the back of the truck now. Just look at that interior design. It's, they did such an amazing job with this truck. You got some more storage space down there. You got your power locks, your power windows, your power side steps, which I already showed you guys down there. And just look at this interior. It's insane. This has got to be one of the nicest interiors that I've ever, ever seen in my life. And then we're going to climb up here. And then right here, you got your little nice divider. You press this right here. And then you got your nice little cup holders back here. Now... Just to show you guys, you can definitely fit car seats back here because there's that much room back here, which is pretty cool. 
as you guys can already see lots and lots of space and then you got more storage space down there which i can show you which is pretty cool as well so you got a lot of storage space in here a lot guys and then show you guys this side i just can't get over how nice this interior is i just love that look on the doors and then you got some more storage space down here and then you got your nice cup holders right there you got usb charge ports right there with the heated and ventilated seats for back here as well which is really nice they just did an absolute amazing job with this truck guys insane insane job and then right here you have a little code set up so that way every truck that has one of these you have a different little code that they give you inside of your user manual which you can see when you get the truck it comes with a different kind of code and then you just type that in anytime you forget your keys in your truck which is a pretty pretty cool feature because let's face it sometimes we forget our keys in our cars guys and that is just a really great feature to have now you get power locks power windows power side mirrors you got the nice storage space down here got the B&O sound speakers right here you got memory seats you got that nice wood interior design and then so you got the 10-way power adjustable driver and passenger side seats now you get the memory seats and you get the memory steering wheel so it's power steering wheel so when you program the seat the way that you want to program it and then the steering wheel you program it the way you want to program it and then the number one button is driver number two is passenger you would hit the number one button if you're in the driver and number two is obviously the passenger so you would hold that button down after you program the seat and the steering wheel the way you want it and then every day when you get back in your truck it's going to go right back to the same position that it went the day before it's a really really cool feature right here are your high beam and headlamp controls and then right here is your tailgate release button which is pretty cool then this is one of my favorite features watch the brake and gas pedal see it come up go down that's a really cool feature guys like so for short or tall people obviously that's everybody you're either short or tall so that's a really good feature to have not too many other places i've ever seen i don't think i've ever seen any other other automaker make it i could be wrong but it's a great a great feature then there is your e-brake and then your brake release and then you got your nice king ranch badge right there which is pretty cool and then get in and then it is push to start so you hold the brake pedal push button to start and then your belt tough sign pops on and then i'm going to show you guys a side mirror which is pretty cool watch it go out come back in pretty cool right and then press this button and then your mirror comes in and then goes back out how awesome is that guys pretty nice right it's also got the 10 speed automatic has got skid plates it's got the low gloss black paint aluminum it's got the rapid heat supplemental heater engine block heater it's got the fifth wheel hitch prep package got the roof clearance lights it's got the adaptive steering it's got wheel well liners front and rear upfitter switches it's got tough bed spray and bed liner the power running boards power moon roof with twin panel it's got the eight inch productivity screen ambient lighting fix it's got Lane keeping alert, mono beam coil spring, FRT suspension with stabilizer bar, pre-collision assist, utility trailer tow, camera system, Ford Pass Connect, 4G, Wi-Fi, Bliss with cross traffic alert, B&O sound system. It's got the belt minder chime, so that way you don't ever forget that your kid's in the back seat or that you forget to put on your seat belts. And it's got SOS post crash alert system, which is pretty cool as well. Now, this truck, is it literally has every different feature you could ever imagine guys so um now to go into your different settings you got your off-road settings your um tire pressure oil pressure all those controls are right here so you just press the side button you can go to your different settings towing status gauge view trip one trip fuel economy all that great stuff all those controls are right here on your steering wheel so it's pretty nice and then you got your bluetooth controls right here and then your volume controls for your radio 
and then you have a universal garage door opener so you can program it into as many houses that you go to which is pretty nice and then right here is your back power window button which is always nice to have that and then right here is your auxiliary switches so if you ever use a plow or anything like that you can hook up all that stuff to your truck and then those will be your little switches to hit when you're using all those things right here you put your nice little stunner shades those gucci ray bands and then right here is your sunroof buttons so your sunroof pop open nice and smooth and then right here, your button for your sunscreen shade. So that way you don't have the sun in your face and all that great stuff. And then right here, you got some more storage space up there. You got the B&O sound speaker up there, which is pretty cool. Right here, you have your traction control button, your hazard light buttons, you got your blind spot controls, and then this is your 360 view camera controls, which is pretty awesome. This is your 360 view camera. This is your front view camera. This is your 360 front view camera. This right here is the back of your bed camera view. I'm not sure why it's not going. And then there's your trailering hookup wires right here. Or not wires, sorry. That's your trailer hookup camera system, but I don't have a trailer hooked up, so it's not gonna do it. So it kinda really sucks. Um, but yeah, to go back into your screen, you have that. And then you, here is your home button. So you can go back into any of your other settings. You got your audio settings, your climate control, your phone control, built-in navigation. You got your different apps, your different settings that you can go into and set up the way you want. And then your heated steering wheel button is right there. And then you got your two wheel drive, four wheel drive and four wheel drive low button. And then you got your trailering controls all right here. And then you got your volume control, you got your radio controls, you got dual climate control, which is really nice. Um, so if you want to be hot on the driver and the passenger wants to be cold or vice versa, you want to be cold, they want to be hot, you could do that. That's the great thing about dual climate control. And then look at this whole setup right here. It's got the wood interior design built into the center console, which is pretty cool. And then right here, you have a wireless charging pad right there so if you have a wireless charging capabilities built into your phone you just pop your phone right there and then you're good to go but if you don't have that you just hook up your wire and then hook up your phone and then you're also good to go then you got some more storage space down there which is pretty nice and then right here you have your cup holders which is pretty pretty nice and then cool feature about this is these you can make this into more cup holders and then or if you want to have some more storage space down here you can do that as well which is pretty cool or you can change it back into cup holders which is pretty awesome and then right here is your center council look how big this snake design is that's the texas snake pretty crazy right that's for the king ranch i love center councils as you guys could already see i'm a really weird person that's just who i am so Go into your center council, and you can already see how big of a center council this is, right? Look how deep this goes. Pretty crazy, right? There's some stuff in there right now because this is a demo truck. But then you got your another storage space right there. You can put your phone on there. You can put change built into the side right there. Anything that you want to put in there. But as you guys could already see, it's a pretty, pretty big center council, and they just did an absolute amazing, amazing job with this truck, guys like an absolute amazing job so again guys thank you guys so much for staying tuned thank you guys so much for watching my video i really appreciate it i'm very thankful and grateful for all my viewers all my subscribers uh i really hope you guys are doing okay out there i couldn't do any of this without you guys so i just want to say thank you guys again uh for watching my videos i hope you guys are staying safe and uh, again may 27th i'm having that iphone 11 pro max giveaway all you guys got to do is hit that like and subscribe button it's totally free to subscribe. All you guys got to do is hit that like and subscribe button, guys. And you guys will be entered in to win a brand new iPhone 11 Pro Max or $1,000, guys. So, again, May 27th is that date. And there will be two winners. So, stay tuned for that, guys. And uh, stay safe. And I'll see you guys soon.